Let's give you a live look right now. This is San Diego, where the big story there tonight involves an investigation into students throwing tortillas after the opposing team at a basketball game. Video shows it happening as both teams went to shake hands after that regional championship game was over. The visiting team from a predominantly Latino district. News Asians Ashley Jacob talked to community members who were calling the incident racist. Several Southern California civil rights activist groups gathered outside Coronado High School saying that the high school basketball team's actions after a recent win were racist. Those children, whoever the perpetrators were, need to understand the actions and the harm that was done, not just to Orange Glen, but also to the immigrant community where they came from, and also all Latinos. Dozens gather outside Coronado High School Tuesday following the weekend basketball game they say ended in a fit of racism. It was a tight game, the heated CIF Regional Championship. Orange Glen varsity guard said the competition started out great. It was, it was very exciting. Exciting going into the game, a lot of energy and like we we're just hype. Each team playing their hearts out, Coronado narrowly winning. When Orange Glen players lined up to shake hands, that's when some of their opposing players started hurling tortillas. I felt like we were like really disrespected. His father couldn't believe it. What happened is not cannot be tolerated. Uh, I see a sign back here, strip them of the championship. No, it's not the championship that needs to be stripped. We have to go directly to the coach and his staff. The fact that those children had to be insulted in front of their parents during a championship game that they had not w witnessed in more than 10 years, it was an insult that every Latino across the nation and who has seen the video understood. Members of the greater San Diego community of all backgrounds stand in solidarity, saying racism will not be tolerated. Coronado School District put out their... Uh, Apology on Twitter, and my statement to that is apology not accepted. Yeah. Yeah. Apology not accepted. I want to see actions. Yeah. Those actions people are calling for range from forfeiting the win to diversity training, even criminal charges. Both district school boards have called emergency meetings trying to decide how to move forward from here. The San Diego Unified School District has offered to be a neutral ground for a roundtable in the future. Reporting from Coronado Island, Ashley Jacobs, News Nation.